Hello my soccer universe, let me show you something, let me show you something, it has happened and this parcel has arrived. Now, if you're completely done for now, what do I mean and this parcel has arrived and what has happened, why is this so good? Please, do yourself a favor and watch this video where I in the end unpack this beautiful Columbia Centenary home jersey. It has been quite the ride for me to getting a Columbia home jersey. I paid full price for this one, which I usually don't do. And why did I want to have a home jersey? Because for the longest of times, this was my first ever Columbia jersey. It was never a problem to getting it. It was beautiful. It's the one from the uh, 2018 World Cup. And then it all hell broke loose with me and Columbia. Now, let me tell the story on this parcel before I open it up. I have already pre-cut it to make the unpacking process a little bit smoother. Of course, I wanted to have a yellow one and I really started in September. Again, at the international break after failing during the Copa America, where I ended up with two fake versions of this one. To really say it cannot be that hard to get a yellow Columbia home jersey. I looked on the internet. Yes, I could get the current one. Honestly, don't like it. This one, love it. But the current one, not so great in my opinion. So, found a few candidates. Among those, of course, also a few that were really nice. Basically, my ideals for a Columbia yellow home jersey. The problem is they were in Great Britain. Because there are so many fake Columbia shirts out there. I wanted to avoid that I have this sent to me. Even if the tags check out. For this, the tag checks out. But it's a fake. It's a fake. Because it's the most faked Adidas jersey of 2018. And the code is on all the Adidas fakes out there. I'm just re-mentioning it because it's such an important part of this entire story. I want to avoid that I get, get, you know, partial refund and you keep the jersey and you have another fake around. Nah, didn't want to do that. So I asked my good friend Andy from Andy's Football Shirts on Instagram. Andy, can you please help me out? Can you try? Here are three options. Can you please check them out for me? Order for me? Check them out and, you know, have them sent back if they are fakes. And we looked at a few options. There was one seller that was actually offering two. And he did his due diligence, contacted the seller, and it turns out we had a live one. And, he, and when he had arrived, he sent it to me and, and said, you know, we have a real one. It's a really, really nice shirt. I was so pleased. And part of my structure was, can you do it quickly so that I have it for the October international break? Well, obviously it's November. We're not having it for the October international break because that's now the second part of the story. He sent it really quickly. He sent it really quickly. I was even considering shall I add another jersey I said no enough jersey you've spent enough this is enough send it to me and at the beginning of October it cleared customs and then it didn't move the freaking parcel did not move what's even worse is I called then after two weeks one and a half weeks I called the postal office you know what's happening with this was, ah we've lost it we cannot track it anymore. That something has happened. Uh, we need to start an investigation. But the sender has to do it. Well, starting investigation might work in Austria. It's not that easy in the UK because you have to submit everything and they only allow you to do it three weeks after the scheduled arrival date, which at that point pulled us towards the end of October. And I thank Andy again for trying to go through the process. It just, he couldn't do it. And I fully understand that. And... Uh, then, last week of October, he sends me again. Shall I try it now? I said, yeah, let's go for it. Let's try it. I hope it turns up. A day later, the bell downstairs rings. The parcel is delivered. So here we have it in a nice purple parcel. We have a yellow Columbia jersey. As I've already pre-cut it. Here. What do you think? What do you think? It's a yellow Columbia jersey. Not only that, it's probably my ideal Columbia home jersey. What did I pay for it? I want to say it was about 45 euros, something like that. So I'm quite pleased with that one. I think if I show you now what is in here, you probably have already an idea which one it will be. Let's have a guess and let's unpack it. Ta-da! 
the one from 2014 World Cup, the one that James Rodriguez scored this beautiful goal against Uruguay. What a jersey. What I didn't like, I said, was one with uh, white pants. But as an overall jersey, as a home jersey, I think this is really, really cool. Maybe, just maybe, you could have made the color in such a way that it's a little bit more Colombia flag, but you know, small potatoes. It's an absolutely gorgeous jersey, especially when you look here at the pattern within this blue stripe. The crest has this kind of hard feel to it. Uh, the Adidas logo, very, very pristine compared it to the mess that is this logo here. This is, looks, looks almost a little bit blurred. And then I actually really like that this, thought, this idea of Adidas of having this arc on the back and in red to add the other color of the country and then, you know, Unidos por un país. It's really, really cool stuff. Let's add it. We finally have the Colombia collection more or less complete for now. Ta-da! Here it is. Of course, this is a very interesting Adidas template and I should have probably shown you before where we have ventilation patches here that actually are kind of a rough material. I find this a rather interesting feature. Of course, also quite some ventilation on the side. It's a little bit different than the one I have from Germany and Argentina who didn't have these features, but it's a great jersey. What makes this jersey even sweeter for me is that, and I've said it, this was actually the first Columbia home jersey that I bought. It was a fake of Wilhaben. I said it there. Not only is this the jersey of one of the best World Cups that Colombia has ever played in and has this beautiful goal with Hamas Rodriguez attached to it. There's also a picture of my currently favorite singer, and she has been for a while, Flora Janssen, wearing this jersey as well. So. There's also a really nice touch to it. I cannot tell you how relieved I am. I will not have to wear this friggin' fake jersey again. If I talk about Colombia, I have now two very valid options for Colombia home jerseys. I have this absolutely gorgeous centenary jersey. I have this really interesting looking 2018 away. Would maybe have been nice to have also the home, but I have to say, this is the better jersey and it has everything that I like from a Colombia jersey. You know, the yellow paired with the blue makes for a really good combination. It's a very interesting pattern on front as well. Yes, the 2013 and the 2015 ones are also really, really nice jerseys that I would have considered. I guess if I'm now really wanting to complete it, I think a red jersey, also from a 2014 World Cup, would add nicely, but I think my wife will get a heart attack because she has been leaving all my Colombia travails for quite a while. The curse is no more. I have three Colombia jerseys that are all non-fake. Two even fit me. This is an L, it fits me. A little bit tight, but you know, it fits well. I've been wearing it as well. So yeah, please let me know what you think about especially this jersey, but my whole Columbia collection in general. I will take this off after this video and I'll probably donate it somewhere. Um, I don't want to make money out of it, to be honest. In any case, please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like these, and I'll talk to you soon about more things in my soccer universe. Bye! Hey there! I really hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon, so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day! Bye!